We're here with wide receivers coach Seth Day. Uh, coach, we are uh, just a couple of weeks away from uh, the spring game. How do you think uh, the wide receivers are progressing so far uh, during spring ball? Yeah, I think we've had a for, uh, you know a progressive spring. Um, you know, we have some guys coming back that have been in the system now they're going on year two, so they feel comfortable in what they're doing. Um, understand what we're trying to do a little bit better, understand techniques. Um, and we have a lot of competition bringing in some guys that, at the mid-year that's creating some competition in the room, so guys are really pushing up for jobs. Um, but I think, we've, you know, we've made some plays this spring that, you know, we didn't last spring. So, uh, you know, I think uh, it's been a positive spring so far. Now we, you know, finish it out, you know, with these last couple of scrimmages in, in the spring game. How do you think the wide receivers are connecting with the quarterbacks, uh, like James and then uh, the new uh, the new quarterback, Jared Dagey? Yeah, you know, I think, uh, you know, with J-Mo being back and those guys kind of going through a season and going through the highs and lows and, you know, being kind of already going through an offseason, having some seven-on-seven -seven sessions that, you know, they've, they've, they've kind of connected and, and, and built some chemistry there. Um, you know, that stuff just continues to grow as they get older and older. You know, uh, with Puda Vong being, you know, kind of a young guy, Pew being a young guy, and, and Datron, you know, just coming in, you know, there's still some time to develop that, but you can see that's progression, progressing through the spring. With Daytron, how is he acclimating himself uh, to the switch from junior college to uh, Bowling Green? You know, yeah, he's you know he's been in a big time, uh, you know, a big time uh, a program before, so he, he kind of understands expectations. Uh, for him, it was just you know understanding the transition um, and the procedures and, and and how we, you know, how we operate around here. Um, but you know, been been very pleased with his uh, with his performance so far. Um, he's a very competitive guy. Um, um, obviously has the skills to make some big plays and he's shown that and he just needs to continue to get better continue to get in the weight room you know put some weight on get, and continue to build his strength but you know he's you know it's kind of sky's the limit for that guy and what are you looking to work on for the last couple of weeks you know continue to, to continue to work our craft you know uh, the defense has given us a lot of different looks that we didn't get um, in the season last year so this new you know new techniques uh, you know working off press um, and, and just making plays on the ball you know I think we struggled a little bit catching the ball last year and making plays when the ball is in the air um, we've done a good job of that so far when you continue to get better and every time the ball is in the air it's our ball so that just having that mentality and, 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 and continue to build on it